Caroline. I fucked up and told her. Turns out, the hurt I tried to spare was mine, not hers. Hello. Your inspiration for me, Captain, to never give up. You got a nice boat, man. Made yourselves a real nice abode here, brother. Yep. Fuck! What's up, Hattie? These fucking radiation scars on my belly. It's like a motherfucker lately. Takes all my willpower not to scratch. Well, they got this amazing scientist here. Set, I think it was. Go see if he got a soothing ointment or something. I don't know, Laney. Don't want to bother him with a fucking itch. And that fucking monkey cat, or whatever it is, just freaks the shit out of me. And you thought we had a freak show with Super Smash back in New York. Ooh, remember when he told the story about he and his daddy went looking for space aliens in the desert and ended up nearly dying of thirst and had to be hospitalized because of all the blisters? <laughs> Man, I tried so hard not to laugh. I miss New York sometimes. May have been a radioactive hellhole infested with Nazi pigs. But it was home, you know? At least it's safer here, sister. Every day we stand alive is a victory, you dig? <laughs> no doubt, no doubt. Yeah. Hello. Peace. Glad to be on board, brother. Hey, Mr. Blasco. Yeah.
Yep. Hey, man. What's up, Mr. Blasco? Hello? What's going on, Captain? Oh, uh, what is the matter, Fergus? Bloody shite I write in letters, how's the matter? Ah, this is a love letter? Aye. No, 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 it's not a fucking love letter. It's a performance review letter for one of the crew members. Huh. Who? Maria works at the fuel hangar depot. Good lass. Okay. So you write like this. Maria, your blue eyes are like the ocean. Shut it. She has brown eyes, not blue. Oh. You have performed your tasks admirably. And I salute your... Passion, spirit. Passion. Then you write, now I would like to admire your blue eyes over some dinner. Right, Max? <laughs> They're brown, you tosser. Yes, yes. Congratulations, Fergus. You have set a new standard for the definition of absolute fucking shite. Oh, I give up. Look at your face, big man. 
pale like ash. You have to take good care of yourself. Long day, Blasco. My friend. Hello, Anya? What is uh, my friend from Warsaw. I can't find anything. He studied mathematics in New York. not city. really in a good mood right now. I mm. never heard from him after Nazis. I was simply bomb. wondering if you would like to do something together later. What? I don't know. Hmm. Recreational activity of some kind. Listen. And listen to me carefully, Sigrun. I've looked through your records. Lists upon lists of atrocities. The Yosemite massacre? Burning of the Baltimore ghetto? Nashville? Stop! I was just following my mother. <gasps> I, no, I am not responsible. I did not commit any of those acts myself. Oh, if you don't trust me, then why don't you just kill me right now? <laughs> but you were there. You stood by and watched it all happen. And you did nothing to stop your mother. She would have thought me weak. An embarrassment. I just... What? I just wanted her to be pleased with me. Oh. <sighs> oh, I'm nauseous now. And I don't know if it's the pregnancy or you. How's it going? The grub you got here on the boat is dynamite. Been living off of mildly radioactive canned goods for fucking forever. Don't underestimate manual labor. Mr. Blaskovich, it clears the mind, makes room for big ideas to move in. me when the bomb fell. Being deep underground, trapped, feeling Mama's hand, or holding on to it. Yeah, but on the upside, there's no radiation, no Nazis, hidden from the world, and we're safer than we've been in like forever. I know, I'm being irrational, Huey, but I can't control it. I'm feeling it, being suffocated. It feels like I can feel the dust clogging up my throat. The heat from the first wave and the screams. The fucking screams, man. Hey, come on, girl. Just breathe. Try to breathe. <sighs> you okay, sister? I'm okay. I'm okay. I gotta get used to this. Hey, man, what's up? This place feels like home already, Captain. Right. Let's see if this bird is ready to fly like Grace asked me to. Put everything else out of your mind. It would be important for the wing commander. A letter from the wing commander. Merci, Mr. Blaskovitz.
Good to see you, Captain. about the New York. Very bad place. Salut, Captain Blaskovitz. Looks like I need more power. Chopper's fat and sassy. Should let Grace know. Hello, Captain. Hello, brother. 